Hi everyone, welcome to today's session. As part of this session, we will be discussing how to change the status of released transport request or task. Uh, most of you, if at all you are uh, working in SAP area from very long time or at least uh, even if you have spent uh, time for a year or so, you would have aware that uh, SAP uses transport uh, management mechanism to capture and move the changes which you have done in development system across the landscape landscape in the sense from development to quality or quality to prod something like that right so all your changes for example if at all you have created any program or if you are a bw consultant if you have created an info object dso transformation those development has to be moved to quality for your integration testing and further to your uat environment and once you are ready to live it has to move to production correct so for that we will use something called transport request to capture all your objects and move across the landscape so now assume that in that process maybe by mistake you might have released the transport or even task associated with a transport in that case is there any way to revoke most of you may not be aware of that option but today i will be explaining you one of the simple sap standard abap program which you can make use even by mistake if at all you have released the transport request or task how can you set it back to the modified version okay so generally you might be aware once the task is released you cannot or transport is released you cannot change it back until and unless if at all you are from a sap basis team or you have a specific authorization correct let us get into the system and see what exactly is the program so let us get into the system so as you are aware uh, this is my sap login screen let us go to sc01 or sc10 sc01 or 10 is used for your transport organizer i am in sc01 transaction code okay transaction sc01 now you display your the transport request you see we have one transport request wherein we can see uh, there is a transport and there is one of the task associated with the transport okay so still it is in modifiable version there is no tick mark tick mark indicate whether it is released okay so now by mistake so i select the task and i click on release directly okay so you can see a success message appeared saying like the task ending with 07 has been released okay so now i cannot make any more changes under this task or else assume that uh, you are not supposed to release this task but uh, uh, you by mistakely you have released how can i set it back so so now if you want to uh, set the status of this uh, the release state back to modifiable state there is an ABAP program given by SAP and this ABAP program is a standard SAP ABAP program let us go to SC38 transaction code which is the transaction for ABAP editor and the program which you are supposed to run is RDD IT 076 okay and this is the standard SAP ABAP program so you just have to click on execute and you have to you will get a selection screen wherein it will ask you to enter a request or task either you can enter entire transport request or you can enter only the task let me just pass only the task as an input and click on execute you see though you pass task even the tr also appeared over here correct so now if you see it has given the the program has given an output in a like uh, the list view format right you see there is something called status status of the task is in r all you have to do is you have to double click see it says r the same thing has been displayed in a pop-up mode if you do the f4 on the status field d means modifiable if you see the main transport ending with the 06 is still in modifiable mode because it is not yet released if it is l means modifiable and protected generally you have now it is set to r you see r means released now we have to set the status of this particular field the status to modifiable okay which is d so what you have to do all you have to do is when you run the program run the program enter your task or tier number execute it it will show all the trans uh, the transport request and associated task you double click on the release status if you want to revoke that back to development mode or the modifiable mode double click click on change button 
now here what you have to do you have to enter d or from the pop-up window you have to choose d and click on save okay that's it so now if you go back uh, to your sc01 and transport request and refresh it uh, this checkbox will go you can have a look see as you saw the now the by mistake if at all you have released the trr transport that has been set it back so now let us redo the same activity one more time let us release the task and let us even release the transport let us see whether this can also be achieved that means the main transport request also can we set the status of main transport request back to modifiable mode now let us go back and enter your uh, transport request number click on execute and in the program all you have to do is double click on the uh, your transport request where you wanted to set the status back to development d which is nothing but modifiable click on save and uh, refresh it back see the status has been set back to modifiable mode okay so hope you have learned as part of this video how to change the status of the released transport request or task back to modifiable mode in this series of videos we will uh, keep learning couple of more uh, useful sap ABAP program which will help us in our day-to-day -day deliverable activities okay so if you like this video kindly like share and subscribe to my youtube channel and also you can pass on this video to your loved ones or your professional colleagues also if at all you are looking for online training on sap bw bw abap hana native ana or hana sql you can always uh, reach out to me on my mail id that is venugopal mn1988 at the rate gmail.com or you can call me on my mobile number that is plus 91 which is india country code followed by 9739839392 Thank you so much and have a good one guys.